The first day of the Arcana Odom Cell is traditionally devoted to horses in training. Offered by the Channel Consignment, the top price of the session was Lot 420, Make Me King. A Group 3 runner-up in his juvenile season, the now three-year-old Dark Angel Gelding, trained by André Fabre, was knocked down for 380,000 euros. He's out of the listed winner Miss Infinity, herself a half-sister to Primoni Victor, the WOW signal. He's very lightly raced, he's a progressive horse. Um, I've actually just was doing the bidding for Richard Brown, my colleague. Uh, so uh, he's, he, I was taking instructions from him on the phone. But he's obviously a horse that I know well as well and, and we discussed. Um, you know, he's, he's one of those horses that they've, they've been running over sort of seven furlongs, but uh, they've stepped him up recently and he's a big stride, he's got a very big stride on him and he's, uh, he's a very progressive horse. Blanford Bloodstock also purchased lot 429 Bishtani, the same gelding who recently denied Make Me King victory in a conditions race on Chantilly Racecourse. The son of Siuni is out of a full sister to Grand Prix de Paris winner Bekabad. They went to the line together head and head, so uh, he actually won. So uh, you could possibly say he's good value considering that uh, Make Me King made 380s. Selling out of the yard of France's champion jump trainer François Nicole, lot 452, Quinzebourg, brought 355,000 euros. The three year old gelding by Dr. Dino is out of a group performer, ex fan des 60s. He raced twice and won twice. He's a fine big horse. Um, he looks like a chaser, so he, he's done well to do what he's done really at three. You know, he's a gorgeous looking horse and um, he's plenty of size about him. And um, he's by the right sire out of a good broodmare sire, probably lot, so you can't get much better than that. The expert recruiting trio, Pierre Boulard, Harold Kirk and Willie Mullins spent 300,000 euros to secure lot 401, Zillow a three-year-old colt by Zofani from the maternal line of French Oaks winner, Egypt Band. He's very well bred and physically he's very strong, very correct. We just love the horse, you know. We'll go first over the jump and then back on the flat, like, you know, like Willie really likes to do. You know? Really impressive physically, you know, and recommended by Christophe Ferland as well, you know, which is a plus. We've been lucky with him before. The Mullins team was the top buyer for the day, making five purchases for over 800,000 euros. They're heading home with lot 433, Kursk de Tay, lot 470, Quelle Histoire, lot 467, Manon, and lot 46, Capagipic.